First, thread the cable through the machine. Next, thread the bolt, part number 82, into the lock washer, part number 102, and the washer, part number 71. Place the pulley into the first pulley housing on the frame. Insert and hand tighten the bolt. Now continue to thread the cable through the machine. As you get to the next pulley housing, thread the bolt, part number 82, into the lock washer, part number 102, and the washer, part number 71. Now place the pulley into the pulley housing, ensuring the cable is outside the pulley. Insert and hand tighten the bolt. Now route the cable up through the next pulley housing located under the back of the machine. Thread the bolt, part number 84, into the washer, part number 71. Now insert the pulley into the pulley housing so the cable can route up and over the pulley. Place the bolt into the machine. Secure the bolt with the washer, part number 71, and a nut, part number 90. Secure the cable in place by adding the top bolt, part number 105, and a nut, part number 106. Now prepare the next bolt by threading a bolt, part number 81, into a washer, part number 71. Then place the next pulley into the pulley housing, with the cable routing underneath the pulley. Secure the bolt into the machine with washer, part number 71, and nut, part 90, on the opposite side. Prepare the next bolt by threading a bolt, part number 109, into a washer, part number 71. Then route the cable up over the next pulley and place it into the upper pulley housing on the main frame. Secure the bolt into the machine with a washer, part number 71, and a nut, part number 90, on the opposite side. Now route the cable through the opening of the third pulley housing and up and out of the fourth pulley housing. Prepare the next bolt by threading a bolt, part number 109, into a washer, part number 71. Then route the cable underneath the next pulley and place into the third pulley housing on the lower frame. Secure the bolt into the machine with a washer, part number 71, and a nut, part number 90, on the opposite side. Assemble the bolt, part number 83, into the spacer, part number 45, and then place the pulley on top of the cable and insert the bolt, part number 83, into the frame. Then tighten with the other spacer, part number 45, washer, part 71, and nut, part 90. Now push the foot pad of the machine into the starting position. Hand tighten the cable anchor, item number 49, onto the cable bolt. Now slowly push the foot of the machine up to insert the cable anchor. Secure the cable anchor in the frame using the shaft, item number 50, and secure with washers, items 71, and the nuts, item 90, on both sides. Now use a 3 8 inch or 5 16 inch socket wrench to wrench tighten all the previously hand tightened bolts in the pulleys and the nuts on the cable anchor.